Alrighty folks, it's safe to say that that challenge was annihilated. Now I'm gonna try to find a place to sleep and uh, yeah, wake up tomorrow and go to LA. The next day. Oh my goodness. Wow, lovely death. Well, we made it the first night and I didn't get stabbed. So that's awesome. Let me just say that I don't like eating spicy burritos and it's for a good reason because yeah, it doesn't feel too good in my stomach right now. <laughs> but I am uh, still here and still in one piece. Plan for the day is I was gonna go on a little hike and then probably go hit the gym here in LA. Well, I'm actually not even in LA, but go to LA, hit the gym. I've done some research and there's a lot of challenges that have discontinued and most of the challenges that are still going on are ones that I've already done. So I'm gonna try to find one. If I don't, then I'll probably just chill out in LA and probably go head up north and uh, yeah, that's going to be the plan of action because LA kind of sucks to be in during the week, so I don't really plan on being here for a while. Yeah. First uh, Starbucks stop of the trip. Time to go on a hike. Well, we're all done with the hike and everything. It only took me about an hour, and uh, I got my first parking ticket. Sweet, $68. That sucks. I guess it's just, uh, let's see, society's way of spitting in my face after getting free food last night. Speaking of free food, I am going to be calling a few restaurants around before I go train next. Gonna go train, probably hit some light legs. Yeah, if I can't find anything in the LA area, I'm probably just going to chill here for a day and then go up north. Alrighty guys, so I am done with my hike. I'm actually at the gym right now. So here's the deal, I called around to a bunch of restaurants and there's only one challenge that I can actually do today. I have to do it today because they're closed tomorrow and it's an eight pound burger challenge so I'm actually going to <laughs> Uh, squat for a little bit and then do some light cardio and then head over there. It's gonna be pretty rough uh, to do all this But I ate seven and a half pounds of burrito yesterday, so uh, This may not be the wisest choice, but it's the only challenge I have to do and uh, Yeah, so we'll see what happens So that was a pretty killer workout. I actually, I don't know guys, it's uh, it's another level when you train. I know it's been like a day and everything, but well, it's been like 16 hours or so since the burrito challenge, but whew, I can, I, I wish it was a heavy day. I wish it was a power day. I don't really train heavy on the weekends, but tomorrow we'll see where the bench goes. Um, but here's the thing guys, I am going to be doing another challenge tonight. Now, it's not going to be exactly 24 hours after a challenge, and I normally don't do things like this, but they're not going to be open tomorrow, and I don't plan on staying in LA for another day. Yeah, I'm going to be here tomorrow, probably just recovering from the challenge I'm going to do tonight, but tonight it's going to be an eight pound burger. Just the burger is eight pounds, and we have fries, and then I actually have to do a shake with it too. I'll update you guys more with the specifics in a little bit, but I am right now going to go head over to the area so I don't get stuck in traffic and uh, get some stuff at Walmart. <sighs> Before I go, hydration. It's very, very, very. <sighs> Important. So we have Louisiana fried chicken right there. Burger Palace right there. It's about to get crazy. Really crazy. Alrighty guys, here's the deal. They didn't really have what I needed. I needed to get a blanket. And yeah, I'm gonna, I'm actually really surprised I didn't get these sooner. Uh, yeah, I am just that cheap bastard that doesn't buy Tums. And I buy the uh, crappy uh, version of them. So, got that. I had to get some gum too. This is a lifesaver on the road. Um, I'm gonna call the place here in a few minutes and get everything set up and ordered. I just know that this is gonna be a pretty insane challenge. I haven't done a burger challenge in a while, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. 
Hi there. Um, I actually called a little bit earlier about your burger challenge that you guys have. So she let me know to just give you guys the 30 minute in, in advance before I came in. So I just wanted to call and let you guys know that I'm going to be there. Uh, you're going to be down today to do the burger challenge? Yeah. Around what time? Um, I should be there probably by 5.30. And my name is Eric. And we are here at Oh My Burger. If I can find parking. It's time to do a burger challenge. Alrighty guys, so here's the drill. The Oh My Burger challenge. I have 50 minutes to do this. It's an eight pound burger and it has bacon, pastrami, and it's got french fries and I got my choice of shake and I went with strawberry. Other than that, I, I don't know, I'm gonna try to get it down. I'd like to get it down in 30 minutes, but anything over that 20 minute mark and you start to get kind of bored with the food, so I'm gonna try to get it down. And uh, yeah, apparently two people have done it out of hundreds, so we're gonna see what happens. I just found out that my good friend Molly Schuyler did this challenge in 15 minutes, so I don't think I'm gonna do it in 20, maybe 25, 30, if I'm lucky. Eight pound burger challenge. That is massive. So Eric, you're recording. Are we live? We're live. You're live. Your burger has 10 quarter pound patties, American cheese, 10 slices of bacon, half pound of pastrami, barbecue sauce, order of onion rings, a side of fries. He has dipping sauces and where's our milkshake? Alrighty everybody, welcome back to another video. We are here at OMG Burger. Uh, we're about to take on their burger challenge. Now this is eight pounds of food right here, and then we also have french fries. I believe they're 12, 12 ounces of french fries, onion rings. I even have a shake right here. I also have some delicious vegetables on here as well. All in all, I have to do this in 55 minutes. And if I do that in 55 minutes, I get the meal free. Uh, I also have some sauces on the side too. Gotta have variety here. So, onion rings are vegetables too, I guess.
the video everybody stay tuned for the next challenge <laughs>